If you live in the Edmonton area, or almost anywhere in Canada for that matter, you've likely noticed how quick homes are selling around you. So that's why we're here today with Need to Know with Nicole, Seller's Market. Starting with some facts. A seller's market is where the seller has the upper hand because there are more buyers than there are sellers in a particular market segment. The scenario looks a little something like this. A home pops up on the market in a hot and desired segment, either by home type, location, or price point, or all of the above. And the first day on market, there are dozens of showings. Buyers are literally lined up outside the door to get in and take a peek. That's a little like how a seller's market looks like in the wild. Now in a seller's market, a home receiving more than one offer, or multiple offers as it's referred to, is quite common. It all boils down to low housing inventory and strong buyer presence. What we can see sometimes emerge in a seller's market, and what I've heard some sellers lately when I meet with them is, Nicole, why would we market our home and put time in to prepare for sale when everybody's house is selling no matter what? Often this comes up in my consultations because I offer a full and comprehensive marketing plan for my sellers. This includes high-end professional photography, 3D tours, and really stylish video, kind of like the one you're watching right now. But my answer is always the same, and I'll share it with you today. Why would you leave potential money on the table? If we present your home with a full and proper marketing package and you take a little bit of extra time to prepare your home for sale, that could actually mean the difference between five offers and 10 offers. And I can tell you, buyers are much more likely to put more money on the table if they're competing with more people. If we can increase the demand of your property, that will very likely result in selling your home for more money. To me, the house homework or pre-listing prep is even more crucial in a market like this because we want to make sure that buyers fall in love with your home quick, equating to more showings and more hype for your property. Doesn't everyone want their house to be the talk of the town, the one everybody wants to buy? I think so. And a little bonus fact for you, sometimes in a seller's market like this, sellers are compelled to try selling their properties on their own, which of course is your right and choice to do. But I'll leave you with this. Selling your own home comes with more liability, more stress, and again, could leave money on the table. Let a trusted and proven real estate professional, like me, guide you through the complexities of multiple offers, hectic showing schedules, and high-end marketing. And you will very likely walk away from your current home feeling happier, taken care of, and heck, probably with more money in your pocket. This has been Need to Know with Nicole, and I'll see you on the next episode.